All right, I'm trying to load this old Jeep today. It was a blast to drive for the 30 minutes that it lasted about 20 years ago. We bought it for a hundred bucks. I think we each threw in about $10. Willis four cylinder and it was stuck in four wheel high with no brakes. So we drove it home and almost made it home before we overheated it and killed it. Drove it till it blew up. Now it needs to go and I've got to load it by myself. So at some point you'll notice there's a winch attached to the trailer, but I did not have a battery with me. Go alone. I've got half a brain and a lot of determination. And I found that that will get you pretty far in life. It seems like you just need to be 50% smarter and work 50% harder. But we seem to have lost that in this country. So I've blocked the trailer and I'm going to use the truck to drag the Jeep up onto the trailer. But the Jeep doesn't really steer very well and most of the tires are flat. That's the way it goes sometimes. You're probably going to find out that life in general gets pretty hard, especially after high school. Uh, it seems like with work in general, so many kids are afraid of work and they're afraid of challenges these days. As humans, we seek pleasure and try to avoid pain, but that really stops us from growing as people and individuals. Uh, the challenges, any challenge, you know, this challenge, whatever it is, these are the things that build character. You really need to be challenged every day. Uh, if you're not challenging yourself every day, then you need to find some kind of hobby. If you're not challenged in your job, then man, you know, what are you doing? Uh, do something, do something to improve yourself every single day. I work with high school students and I guess we all have that attitude of, um, you know, high school doesn't really matter, but I think that people don't realize how much you learn in the education system. You take it for granted because everybody else around you has gone through the same system. And so we're all able to communicate and share certain ideas and we take it for granted that a lot of that the science and the math and the language portion of that we have been taught um, you know maybe our parents read to us or did whatever and helped us with our homework but you've, you've learned a lot of this in school you learn more in school than you ever realize right now you can look at all the science going into this with you know levers and leverage and fulcrum points etc cetera, etc cetera. You know, I didn't realize it when I was learning this in school, but it's important and here it is mattering. Take a look around you and notice all of the different things that are going on. Everything matters. So really you should be paying attention to everything around you. If you're not noticing all of the different things around you, the different scenarios, the different places you go, uh, you're, you're really missing out. And another thing, notice the dumbasses. Especially if you're in high school, uh, look around. If you're not noticing that there's a lot of dumbasses, guess what that means? It means that you're probably one of them. Try to be interested in everything. Try not to get mad when things aren't going your way. You know, the whole time I'm loading this, it's just everything is fighting me. But it's just the way it is. I still have a temper. I struggle with anger. But... As I keep getting older, luckily I keep getting to wake up, I realize that that anger never serves me. And only think about the part that you're working on. So remember, be determined. Think your way out of a situation. Use whatever you have around you. The more that you pay attention to the challenges that you're going through, the easier it becomes to problem solve. So to sum it up, Stupid man refuses to learn. A smart man learns from his mistakes. Suck it, Jeep. A wise man learns from the mistakes of others. I would like to be at the end, but I think I'm pretty much still in the middle. So I hope this helps at least one person out there. Remember, if you're going to be dumb, you better be tough.